Tonight, early voting is underway across Arizona, and we are getting our first update from Maricopa County election officials. Just beginning, our political editor, Dennis Welch, is live in the newsroom tonight. Dennis, what was their message today? Two years ago, Maricopa County became ground zero for baseless claims of election fraud. So to get out in front of any kind of misinformation, this time around, county leaders are expected to give us some weekly updates from now until the election on November 8th. And today they focus heavily on the numbers. Now, currently there are 12 early voting sites that are open. Now, expect that number will ramp up drastically as we get closer to Election Day. As of right now, roughly uh, about 1.9 million ballots have been mailed out to voters as of yesterday. Now, many people likely found them in the mailboxes today, but for anybody who didn't, election officials say it can take up to two to six days for those ballots to arrive. And given the added attention on the election process, County Ch uh, Chairman Bill Gates acknowledged they're handling a lot of information requests from the public while also dealing with a lot of legal challenges. But he assured the public today that, that won't get in the way of running a fair and accurate election. Part of the transparency is responding to requests, is responding to lawsuits. So we can do both. But, but for our voters out there, we do not want them to think that folks that may be trying to distract us with these lawsuits, with uh, uh, litigation holds and things like that, if they think they're going to distract us from the important work, they're not going to. And now, early polling locations opened yesterday. Now, as of yesterday, it was about 313 voters cast those ballots at those early voting stations. Another 129 uh, voted today as of 2 p.m. So not a lot of numbers right now, but that's going to pick up, obviously, in the days and weeks ahead. Back into you.